You know, sometimes you forget that you were doing a YouTube channel. <laughs> Happens to everybody, right? I mean, come on. I'll be back. That's how I should have ended my last video. So in the time that I haven't been doing Vsauce, uh, I've cut down on my drinking, which has allowed me to get white girl wasted right now. Guys, it's 4.30 in the morning on a Thursday, and I'm hammered. My priorities in life, quite good. If my life were a chart, there'd be an upward line, which is my age, and then a downward spiral as it goes on. So, cheers. Summer is upon us, and you'll most likely be near some sort of body of water in the next few weeks. In fact, you wanna hear some pool party tips? All right, here we go. Bring booze, serve booze, drink booze. Good to go. Bottom line is, you need a drink that is cool and refreshing for those hot summer days. For this drink, you're gonna need gin, agave nectar, a cucumber, some limes, and mint. Hi. Hi. I'm a cucumber. <laughs> so first you're gonna chop up some of your fruits and vegetables, uh, because apparently this is a salad again. You limey bastard. Ah. So now take... Now take your cucumber and slice off an inch long Piece. That was really hard to do, guys. You're also gonna wanna peel the uh, skin off, otherwise uh, your drink's gonna taste like straight up pickles, um, and you don't want that. Again, this is just a salad. I mean, now you're gonna stack like six or seven mint leaves together, and then you're just gonna slap them. Just slap them like they've been no good to you. Slap it like it's someone else's booty, and you want it. I'm not just doing this because I'm crazy. Slapping helps release the oils inside the mint. Okay, now that we have all of our food prepared, let's grab a cocktail shaker. Add your cucumber, your mint, cucumber, I really know her. Ah. Now you're gonna add one teaspoon of agave syrup. I'm using agave syrup instead of sugar uh, because agave is low on the glycemic index, which means it won't agave you a heart attack. Everything in moderation, kids. What? Now you're gonna muddle this until your cucumber stops resisting your efforts. Guys, this is an upper body workout, just by the way. But that's okay, we're trying to get buff. My muddler doubles as a maraca because this was free and you should always take free things. Okay, now you're gonna fill this uh, all the way to the top with ice. Boy, do I really wish I had some ice in here. Oh my God, it happened. That was a magic trick, guys. Squeeze in half of your lime. This is also effort. If you don't like exerting effort, this may not be the task for you. Now you're gonna add two shots of gin. Ginning. Pop it, lock it, shake it. See how frosty that is? See how frosty that is? See how frosty? It should be that frosty. Look at it. Guys, do you ever worry that puppies don't actually like you? I worry about that sometimes. Grab a martini glass. Yeah. Guys, this is so pro right now. If you don't have a strainer, I highly suggest you get one because it captures all of your like things that you don't want in your drink. Your final step is to garnish with some mint. Uh, but before we do that, we're gonna do some rapid fire puns. I hope I can garnish enough courage to drink this. There's really a garnish market for mint. <laughs> garnish you. All right, I think we're done. And there you have it, a cool as a cucumber gimlet. Oh, if you're not cooled down by this drink, you must be too hot to handle. Oh, this is really good. So what have we learned today? Your drink can be a salad if you try and believe hard enough. Hey guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm gonna do a video every Monday and Friday. Drink recipes, reviews, and nightlife. I am here to make those things accessible for you. 
So please subscribe. I will try to keep the puns at a minimum. That's not true. We both know that's not gonna happen.